What are the symptoms of each and how can we tell the two apart? You know, it's very challenging. They're both respiratory illnesses that have a very similar pattern of symptoms, especially the systemic symptoms. You can feel fever, headaches, muscle aches, chills, cough, sore throat, runny nose, actually with both of those infections. Now with Omicron, what we're seeing is that we're tending to have sort of head up involvement, so to speak. So it's behaving more like a cold where you have congestion, maybe headache, um, but not necessarily a ton of fever. Some people are having fatigue, but not so much muscle aches. On the other hand, the flu, of course, can be head up because it can involve those same types of symptoms, but also tends to have more of a systemic activation. So you will have fevers when you have the flu. You will have muscle aches or pain. Some people can have shaking chills. We're seeing more of that with the flu this year. Now, is there anything that you should do differently if you think you have the flu over if you think you have coronavirus? So it's really important if you're feeling any kind of respiratory symptoms to have what I call a respiratory panel plus the COVID-19. ABC 10's medical expert, Dr. Pyle Coley, tells us the good news is there are numerous readily available ways to prevent illness. The COVID vaccination and, of course, the flu vaccination, you have to get those if you have not gotten them. But, of course, other strategies like wearing masks, washing your hands, keeping your distance, not touching your face will work to prevent both of these illnesses as well.